Got that blazer on. Hashtag business chic. Hey everyone and welcome to Web Love Wednesdays where I tell you about the people and places on the web that I am loving this week. And as I do it, I'm gonna break it down by platform. So let's get started. So for YouTube, I'm kinda gonna talk a little bit about one of my guilty pleasures, which used to be the series Cheerleaders on Awesomeness TV, but unfortunately Cheerleaders is no longer going to be made and airing. So there was a recommended video, and they have an entire new series called Cheerful Out. It is with the Gym Time Blink team, which is the black, it's the combination of their black and pink, uh, I believe it's large open international team, um, which, I don't understand the full dynamics of all the all-star teams, but if you want to learn more, you guys can probably just Google what division they're in and what that means for it. But what's great about this series in comparison to Cheerleaders is that not only are the episodes longer, are some of my favorites from Cheerleaders are actually on there now, like Gabby Butler and Robert. Um, the two of them are on there, and apparently Michael Eddy will be coming in, which is really cool. But what I like about this series in comparison to Cheerleaders from Awesome Miss TV is that with the episodes being longer, it's actually more about the process and really less about like storyline, but really about like what it takes to build a team and like about the skills. And it's really interesting to see as someone who's an ex cheerleader because I still love the sport and I appreciate what it is. Um, if I ever catch nationals on ESPN, I usually stop and watch it and I don't care how long it's gonna be on because it's awesome. So now moving on to Twitter. So for Twitter, I'm going to talk about kind of one of those accounts that you just follow because it's just really there and it makes you laugh and funny, but it's going to be Common White Girl. Um, just a lot of really relatable stuff, also really stupid stuff, but it just, it's fun to look at. I don't know because there's a lot of stuff that I'm like, that's me, and there's a lot of stuff that I'm like, that's a lot of people that I know. So yeah, go follow Common White Girl on Twitter. Now moving on to Vine. So my Vine crush this week is actually a friend of mine who's an extremely talented musician. His name is Theo Katzman, and he just moved to LA a couple months ago, and his Vine has been making me laugh. Um, he'll do everything from the Uber song to a red light like rock concert Aerosmith with harmonica solo. So I love Theo's Vine account. Go check him out. Follow him there. Revine his stuff. Like it. And if you haven't checked out his original music, he has a great EP out called Romance Without Finance, that's amazing. He also has a single called um, Pop Song, which is fantastic. And here's to hoping 2015 is the year that he releases more music because I got to hear some of it last night at his concert and it was fantastic. So go follow Theo. Now moving on to Instagram. So the Instagram account that I'm really loving on, um, I found through another one of the makeup artists that I follow on Instagram posting about, but it is a Instagram account called Dupe That, and they talk about affordable dupes and product reviews and like beauty news, and I really like them because they show like swatches of, let's say, Wet n Wild Red versus like Ruby Woo from MAC, and I just really like the stuff that they're doing. Um, I think it's really cool. I'm hoping that they'll continue to do more stuff It's not just lipsticks right now because it's a lot of lipsticks. Um, I'd love to see more eyeshadow comparisons and foundation comparisons and primer comparisons. Um, and I'd really love to see someone do a dupe of the Makeup Forever Flash Palette versus the one that's the off-brand version but essentially the exact same thing. Or maybe comparison to like the Ben Nye one. So yeah, now moving on to website and other. So my website or other is actually going to be an app this week. It is the app TimeHop. If you don't know what TimeHop is, it is an app for both Android and iOS devices where it essentially goes through your social media uh, history and tells you what you were doing last year or two years before th or three years before on if you connect to like Facebook and Twitter and Instagram and all that stuff. So let's see, last year I talked about wearing this cute outfit with my Mad Moon Ryan t-shirt and how to rock it with a blazer. So talk about meta. Um, oh, and I think last year was like the premiere of Jimmy Fallon on SN on um, The Tonight Show. So there's that. And then there's a lot of pictures of when Michelle and Tanya were in LA. So 
that was my time hop a couple of years ago. So that about does it for my web crush Wednesdays. As always, if there's someone or some place on the web that you are really crushing on, let me know in the comment section below and they may become a part of my web crush Wednesdays in a future week. As always, there are also links to everything that I talked about and links to my social media in the description bar below. As always, don't forget to give this video a nice big thumbs up. Hit subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye guys.